As concern grows over safety of air and rail travel in the United States, the chair of the National Transportation Safety Board testified before Congress today. Ivan Rodriguez breaks down her testimony and where things stand in critical investigations. Accidents. National Transportation Safety Board Chair Jennifer Hammondy testifying before the full Senate Committee on Commerce, Science and Transportation on the more than 1,000 active investigations the agency is conducting. We owe it to the families of those involved, to the communities where events occurred, and to the traveling public to find out what happened. Key among those investigations, the terrifying mid-air door plug blowout and emergency landing of a Boeing 737 MAX 9 flight. Hamandi ripped into the airplane manufacturer for failing to produce key documents related to the incident. There is one team, one team that deals with the doors of 25 people. Why we don't have those names today, two months later is um, really disappointing. This just days after the FAA issued a report finding multiple problems with Boeing's production practices following a six-week audit triggered by the door plug failure. While the company did not immediately respond to Hamandi's testimony, CEO Dave Calhoun previously issued a statement promising a comprehensive action plan for improvements. During her testimony, Hamandi also addressed recent runway incidents and the ongoing staff shortages at air traffic control. A government funding package currently making its way through Congress includes support for hiring new controllers. Hiring is key. The FAA uh, has set goals for hiring. What we're not talking about is the people who leave every year, which is about half. In Atlanta, I'm Ivan Rodriguez.